this video, I'm going to show you how you can get your hands on some surplus toner cartridges from the US government at a fraction of the cost. Hey, what's up guys? James here. I've been running a surplus toner reselling business for over 10 years and today I want to show you how I buy surplus toner cartridges from the government. A lot of people don't know this, but the government regularly sells off their excess, unused, brand new toner cartridges every month and you can get your hands on them at a fraction of the retail price if you know where to look. I've been doing this for many years now and it's actually quite easy. You might be asking, why am I sharing this with you? Won't this bring competition for me? Yes, but there's plenty to go around for everyone, honestly. Plus, there's a competitive advantage you may have over me. So stay tuned for that. Let's dive right in. One of my favorite sites I use to search for new name brand toner cartridges is GovDeals.com. GovDeals describes itself as an online marketplace that provides services to government, educational, and related entities for the sale of surplus assets to the public. Which basically means it's an online auction site the government uses to sell their unwanted stuff to consumers like us. It's like eBay for the US government. The reason I like GovDeals is that they're one of the most popular government auction sites out there. And because of that, they cater to most, if not all, of the US government agencies or entities nationwide, unlike any other auction sites that only work with counties or cities in select states. Their website doesn't look sleek or sexy, but it gets the job done. They have tens of thousands of active listings that you can browse through. Search engine and filtering is efficient. Finding items is pretty simple. Just type in the keyword, press enter, and live listings show up immediately. Before you can participate in the auctions, first you'll need to register as a bidder and provide your contact information. It takes only a few minutes and is free. So once you're done, you can log in and start searching and bidding on products. Select the auction you want to look at, view the auction items, the current bids, number of bidders, and some picks too. Be sure to read the description of the listing carefully and make sure the cartridges are in the condition you want. Most listings provide enough photos and wording that'll allow you to know exactly what you're buying. If not, you can always ask the seller a question and they'll respond pretty quickly. They also have customer service available 5 days a week from 8am to 7pm Eastern if you have a problem or question about your account. When you start bidding, keep in mind that there is a fee called the buyer's premium which GovDeals charges the buyer. This fee typically ranges between 5 to 12.5% depending on the seller. When winning an auction, paying is very easy. You can choose between payment methods such as PayPal, credit card, or a wire transfer. If you win an auction and don't pay within 10 business days though, they will lock your account. Also, most sellers do not pack and ship services, so you'll need to contact the seller regarding the logistics before bidding. There are third-party pack and ship services you can hire to handle the transportation for you, but that can add up quickly if your items are big and heavy. Plus, make sure you provide the person picking up a buyer certificate, or the seller won't let him or her in at the pickup location. And finally, there's no return or refund policy. So if you bid on something, you better be sure the items are in the condition you're expecting. So if you haven't realized it yet, the secret has to do with your location. The competitive advantage that I was talking about earlier in the video has to do with how close you are to the pickup location of the winning auctions. If you are extremely close, you don't have to worry about pack and pick services, which will help you save a lot of money and costs on the logistics. And typically, if you're close by, you can also personally verify the contents of auction by going there before the auction closes so you can check the condition of the items. This is ideal because you won't have to hire any third-party services to do all of the handling, the packing, and the shipping for you, which can add up over time. And if you're operating on a small profit margin, sometimes these auctions aren't worth it if you have to include the cost of the logistics. If you feel this video was helpful, feel free to click the like button below and subscribe for more tips on how to find toner cartridges at bargain prices.